I'm Lee Schofield, the CEO of Alliance Airlines. We celebrated our 15th anniversary back in uh, April, uh, and I think the fair to say the core part of our business uh, during all of that time and, and continuing today has been providing uh, air services to the resources sector, so predominantly fly and fly out activity. The concept of uh, having a purpose-built uh, aerodrome at Cape Preston is uh, something that we've uh, had an enormous in interest in from the start and it's been very exciting to be involved with. Firstly, improving the efficiency of our workforce logistics and secondly, making, uh, improving the experience really for our workforce when they fly in and, both, and when they fly out. Um, we're saving some time on their day-to-day. -day. Um, we're improving the fatigue management, um, but we're also increasing the productivity of everyone's swing. Matthew Horton, I'm a project manager at Silic Pacific Mining. This is my first ever train, yes. Certainly that's, that's something that Silic gives all of its employees, really. There, there are new challenges all the time. DECMA was established in uh, 1979 uh, mainly to provide contract services to the mining and resource sector in the Pilbara of Western Australia. Probably peaked at about 70 people, um, staff blue and white collar on the project uh, at, at peak for about three months in the middle, so yeah, it was quite a big project for us. And DECMA have always, all the way through the process, been very quick to react to, to our changing needs. This uh, project uh, was awarded to us in September 2016 uh, with mobilisation in October and uh, the project completion was April, so six months in duration, uh, so very fast tracked. One of the great parts about this facility is that it is purpose built, it's, uh, um, it's designed with efficiency in mind. Uh, Alliance has been uh, a partner of Citic and for a long time now and view them as uh, one of our great customers. Their, their success is very closely aligned uh, with ours. From the beginning, uh, Citic helped us uh, at no end in providing support. Uh, obviously, uh, their first words were, we need you to succeed for us to succeed. So we had a great relationship, working relationship with Citic. Both Deckman and Alliance have significant Western Australian presences um, and that's important in the selection of contractors as we go forward. Um, particularly around our operational contracts as well, because when, you know, the construction, you look for specific skills, but operationally there are things that WA-based companies can bring in, and, and Alliance have done that. Even with the ongoing management contracts they have here, we're also using Caratha Asphalt as a subcontractor to maintain our facility, and they're obviously based just up the road. Um, some of the ground crew are locally based as well, who Alliance are subcontracting. So wherever possible and wherever we procure, we try and do that as locally as we can. Uh, and the operations into the Pilbara are a lot, the lion's share of our work in, uh, in Western Australia, so absolutely uh, significant part of our business and very close to our heart. Enormous amount of pride going into getting the facility up and, up and running uh, on time and, and on budget. It looks really good, we're very happy for it. I'm very proud and, and pleased to have had the opportunity to work on the project and, and hope that it stands the test of time for, for, for the remainder of Sinai.